Okay. Hello, everyone. I greet you all with your time, your seat, in your places. And when I go to Timothy Mark, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Okoye Timothy Mark. You can also like and comment for experts in academics. Calculations made easy and hidden secrets in dealing with different topics in academics, especially science subjects for those who are preparing for work, jump, for future and even international examination and scholarships. Today, I want to show us the secrets of division of whole numbers by nine. Whenever a whole number that is less than nine is divided by nine, the answer is simply zero point. That number repeated indefinitely. The example, one all over nine gives you zero point one 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 one, which implies that one over nine is invariably eleven point one 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 percent when you multiply by hundred. We have seven over nine. Is zero point seven 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 seven. Continue writing. Of course, you crown it off with eight by approximation. In the language of mathematics, since you write it as zero point seven with dots on seven, which shows that the that seven is repeated indefinitely. Check eight over nine. That is zero point eight 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 eight. Of course, you end it with nine because you approximate. We set it at 0.84 dots on top of 8 in the language of uh, mathematics. Hence, 7 over 9 is 77.78% when we multiply by 100. 8 over 9 is 88.89% 88 in the language of mathematics when you expect the percentage. Hence, if I have any number that I want to, any whole number that I want to divide by 9, I should just be careful to get the multiples of 9 inside that number. Then the remainder goes with this. For instance, if I have 23 over 9, 23 over 9 is 2 whole number, 5 over 9. So this one now will give you 2.555, which you now end with what? 6. In the level of the now 2.5. Dot. So if I have 230 all over 9, you should understand that 230 is 10 times 23 over 9. So that is 10 times, 10 times 23 over 9. So which means 10 times the result of 23 over 9, which is 2.555. And that should give you 25.55555. Easily. Uh, and the with all 6. Or you say that 230 over 9 is 25 whole number 5 over 9 because 25 times 9 is 225 so that many 5 over 9 will give you 0 0.555555 if i have come to 2.3 over 9 which i know that 2.3 is one tenth of 23 over 9 so it means that the result of 23 over 9 will be divided by by 10. So which is now uh, 2.555555, which I refer to 6. That gives you 0 0.255555566. Now, since I know that 23 over 9 is 2.5555, can I give me 23 over 90? Now, what is 90? 90, this is like saying 1 over 10 times 23 over 9 because 90 is 10 times 9. So which means I will simply divide the result of this by 10. So that still gives you 2.5555555 over 10 which gives 0 0.255555. If I have 23 all over 900, 900 is just pick the, this now 100 times 23 over 9. I know this one already. So what is what I'll just divide 2.5 by 100. That gives me what? 0 
Now, with this, you can see in a nutshell that any whole number, even if you give me something like 407, 407 divided by 9, I don't have any problem with it. I don't have any problem with it. 405 is already 9 times 45. So what I have now is 45 whole number 2 over 9. Now the 2 over 9 is now 2 uh, 0 0.22. So this is now becomes 45.22222. We set at 45.2 in the language of this. So if you now give me 40.7 over 9, already I know that for 407, which is one over 45.2. And 40.7 is 1 tenth. That is like saying 1 over 10 times 4 or 7. Or 9. It, that means I just simply divide this number by, by 10. That is now 4.5222. In the other my that is now 4.5. I'll put dot on the 2 because 5 is not repeated, but 2 is repeated indefinitely. So if you now bring down to 4.07 all over 9, which is 100 on the other hand, 1 over 100. Times 23 or oh, 44 7 over 9. So that gives you now dividing this answer by 100, that is 0 0.45222. Which is as 0 0.452 dot on the 2 because that is one that's very repeated. And so on and so forth. So that is the secret of dividing numbers 1 over by 9. You must be smart. So, like this one we did here. To get the correlation between the up and down. Because somebody can come and say that, okay, uh, also to get me 2.5 over 9. What does it give you? And uh, what you should quickly do, since you, you know this is 2.5 over 9, is to quickly convert this to 25. And that's a 25 over 9. 25 over 9 gives you uh, 2 whole number 7 over 9, which is that 2.77777. Now you don't know what your question is, when you say 2.5, 2.5 is one tenth of this. So you write it down, the United States to divide it down 0.27777, which is at 0 0.27 dot on it. If you don't want to give me now uh, 18, uh, 1.86 divided by 9. I should quickly just, I should not pronounce our one number that I just said one that I exceeded because that is the whole number there. Why well, is this? Then 9 times 20, this will give you 20 whole number, 6 over 9. And 6 over 9 is 0 0.66. So this is down 20 point six 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 six. Of course, it ended with 7. So now you now come back. 1.86 is 1 sixth. On 100 of the guys, 100 of the bodies. So you divide this answer by this. Therefore, 1.86 over 9 is dividing this answer by 100. That gives you 0 0.2066667. So, the secret of division by 9 is big and demonstrated above. With this, you can always divide any whole number and even decimals by 9. Just be smart to know what to do. If you give me one line, or 4,000 4, divided by 9. I don't have to waste my time pressing 4,000. I'll just pick 4 by 9. And that is 0 0.44444. This is the one that will be easier. Then I know that 4,000 is 1,000 times 4. So I will find this answer by 1,000. Therefore, 4,000 all over 9 is 4 is 1,000 times this one. 0 0.44444. Of course, you know that is 444.444, which is written as 444.4 dots, because that is one that we repeated in the decimal parts. Secret addition by nine. So with this, you can always divide any whole number, whether the whole number or decimal, by nine, which is thank you and God bless you. With the secrets I'm giving to you, you can do this faster than any person that's going calculator and very accurate. It's something that I've done over the years and I've always been faster than one that's operating calculator. And uh, even if you bring 
ten percent are phonic calculator. If you give them, you give me questions with this divide or compare, and I will always get it faster than all of them. I'm better at it because I know the secret. You too, you can know the secret. Thank you. See you in the next uh, video. Remember to subscribe, like, and comment and comment my YouTube channel. Okoye Timothy Mark.